In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use this tool, uh, the 2D sectional view tool, to create elevation views. All right, so we'll use this project we've got loaded and just review this so we can see what we're doing. And just to recap the 2D sectional view, if I click once, twice, and a third time, I've got a 2D sectional view. Um, and that view, and center this one, is from this position inwards looking. So we got uh, some sectional views. And if we select properties by right clicking and select hidden line removal, we can see that we can only see the detail which is available. So this window here is this window here, this door is this door. So that's how your um, 2D sectional view works. And notice we've got the view here which we can switch on and off over here. And that's called section view AA. And that is, get this window, and you can see that um, that's what we got AA there. Right, um, so I'm going to use the same tool to create a end elevation view of my building from here. And so I again select the tool and this time I place the tool in front of the building rather through the building. And here if I now right click again, select properties, select hidden line removal OK. So this time I've got a view, but this time no um, cross sections. And if I repeat that once more for a view from this position, click once, click twice, then the third time, right click, properties, hidden line removal, and there we have elevation view from that side. Now as I said before that tool is available in all versions from Visual Building Basic upwards and it will allow you to produce a, um, a set of views which you can print on different sheets of paper and then actually combine using um, an external graphics package if you, if you wish. However in the premium version we have an additional tool located here called the plan layout and the plan layout will actually allow you to take these views and lay them on a larger sheet of paper so to do that bear in mind you must have the premium version to continue from this point onwards select new plan view and this time we're going to select a scale of 1 to 100 because we've got more detail on our sheet which I think previously we had uh, either A3 or A4 sheet selected and yeah, A3 it was so we now want A1 landscape scale 1 to 100 and we can now insert our views let's just um, maximize this so we can see what we're doing and we'll insert um, an elevation view that was our sectional view and our elevation view was this one and our last section view or our last elevation view was this one so there we have it and oh yes I was going to show you how to dimension so for instance We are using the premium version, so that latter feature of the plan layout is available only in the premium version, but the ability to create sectional views and elevation views is available in the basic version upwards. Thank you.